If I've had the confidence to remove my clothes, be fully naked like the DM Oban in front of you, it's like, what more should I be not ashamed of, but why would I not be now comfortable? <laughs> What's up you guys, I'm back with another video, it's your girl original bigger. Guys, as you can tell by the title, this is a different type of video, like I don't normally do like videos like this, but I was watching something the other day and I figured, hmm, that's a good question, like, you know, when is, when's it the right time to get comfortable with a guy? And I feel like a lot of people are gonna have different opinions, which is only right because not everybody thinks the same and, you know, people move at different pace, so, yeah this is what we're going to talk about today in today's video so stay tuned if you're interested and remember to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and if you're a new subscriber hi i'm bigger if you're a returning subscriber what it do what it does you know already thanks for being here thanks for tuning into another video without further ado let's just get straight into the video so the question is when's it the right time to get comfortable with a guy comfortable meaning okay maybe get comfortable enough to eat around him get comfortable enough to fart get comfortable enough to just do normal things just be comfortable around the guy that you're dating seeing whatever the case may be a partner I don't know um, I feel like this is a very complex question because it's just like when's the right time the right time for me could be different to your right timing his right time and her right timing so it's just really complex but all I can do is answer it to the best of my ability and I just feel like okay so if i was seeing someone like you know talking to someone getting to know them whatever the case may be i feel like i would only be comfortable with someone after i've had sex with them like this might sound weird like uh like what about actually like you know like do normal other things first but it's just like i mean once you've exposed like your body to someone you shared your body with someone else um you've exchanged energies done all of that i feel like that's the extreme to me so it's like if you if, if you can do all of that like what's next like i feel like anything that comes after that is minor if that makes sense because sleeping with someone is really major to me so it's just like if i can sleep with somebody i feel like anything that comes after that um shouldn't be a problem like i should now be comfortable with that person because it's just like if I've had the confidence to remove my clothes, be fully naked like the DM Oban in front of you, it's like, what more should I be not ashamed of, but why would I not be now comfortable? It's like, you've seen me at my most vulnerable state or, you know, my most shyest state. So it's just like, anything else after that, I mean, I just feel like it doesn't really matter. Like it matters, but it doesn't really matter because it's just like, let's say you've been talking to someone for a while and it's just like you're talking to them you're getting to know them it's like a lot of things are building up over the time frame of you sort of talking to each other getting to know each other but it's just like okay you've been out on dates you've spoken all night on the phone you know things about each other obviously not everything but you're still getting you're still getting to know each other you're in the process of that and it's just like you do all of these things leading up to a moment where you guys actually like have sex with each other you tell me what more do you need in order to be comfortable with this person when do you get comfortable because i feel like once you once we've already slept with each other there's nothing else to hide like i should be comfortable like i said for me showing my body and being fully naked and exposed like i should be that's like that's like my shyest the most vulnerable moment so it's like if i share that with you I don't feel like anything else that comes after that should be a problem like i should be comfortable with you like now to fart i should feel okay because i done already done the worst in my head to um to poo i should be comfortable because it's like i've already done worse well not worse but i've already done more with you if that makes sense so it's just like those minor things shouldn't matter anymore so i feel like once you have sex with a person that should um that should loosen you up to feel comfortable with the person and get comfortable with them like what else is there to hide like why are you hiding why are you feeling ashamed like 
you've already had sex with this person bear in mind so it's just like anything else after that shouldn't really matter so you should feel comfortable to poo fart vomit you you know what i mean are you not following me like yeah i just feel like that's just my views on that because i seen the question and i was really thinking about it i was like for real like for real because i know some girls or some people they take longer to open up to some people it's just like they could know you for a long while but it's just like they're still not comfortable with you and i totally get that but i just feel like with me and the question that i saw was when do you get comfortable when's the right time to get comfortable with somebody that you're seeing or whatever and i just feel like for me once i have sex with you i feel like i should really be comfortable with you after that i should be able to show my toes in front of you i should be able to just be myself around you i shouldn't feel the need to you know hold back because i feel like oh i'm not comfortable i mean for, but that's just for me anyway because some people might object and feel like nah you can you know you can um talk to someone for like a long 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 time and like not have sex with them but like you're really comfortable with them because you feel like you know them and they know you they know everything about you so it's just like you're comfortable because you feel like they know you based on what you've told them or based on what they've seen but i feel like what really tops the cake is when you actually sleep with someone because it's like you've been doing all this talking all this getting to know each other and then it's just like when it when the moment comes like okay for example okay with that being said like you know talking to someone for a long period of time getting to know them and whatnot okay it might make the transition easier when it when the time comes for you to actually like have sex with this person because just like okay i've been talking to them for a long time i feel as though i know them enough he knows me i know him so it's just like doing this um sex thing now should be easier because it's just like I know probably what he likes what he don't like because of what he's obviously told me he knows the same vice versa like he knows what i like from what i don't like so going into this should feel easy it should be a smooth transition from okay we've been talking now you know me now we're gonna have sex but i just feel like yeah that's true that's for some because I could talk to someone for time on the phone, get to know them, blah, 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 blah. And it's just like, and I'm still not comfortable with you. Why is that? And that's why I say everybody's different because some people, they can talk to someone for a long period of time, feel as though they know them, get to know them and feel comfortable with them. So then when having, when it, when the time comes to like actually have sex with them or take it further, take, take it a step further with this person, like let's say relationship wise or whatever, whatever, or they're in a relationship now, I feel like the moment they have sex that, sex, that should actually like seal the deal for them. Like there's no going back. You should be comfortable with this person and like you've, had sex with them you shared your body with them you are sort of exchanging energy like you know all of that other extra stuff that people was going about when you have sex with people so it's just like you've done all of that so for me once you have sex i should now be comfortable i should be comfortable with you at you know to some extent anyway maybe not fully but i should feel at least 60 percent comfortable with you if you get what i mean but i feel like until you have sex with someone for me this is my opinion so you can't fight me nor beat me for this but for me i just feel like once you have sex with someone you should feel somewhat comfortable with that person because it's like you can talk to somebody for time like you're talking you're talking you're talking you're talking but it's just like you know like how if you was to meet someone you talk to them on the phone and it's just like you get to know them and it's like when you meet them again for the first time since meeting them whenever you probably exchange numbers or whatnot and you meet them again for the first time you feel that weird awkward feeling like that shy that shy type of feeling exactly so if you feel all of that imagine just like talking to someone for time for time for time leading up to the moment where you're actually gonna like have sex with this person once you do that once you build up the courage to be like okay i'm gonna have sex with this person i should now be comfortable with you but that's just me that's just my opinion because i just feel like my body is a big deal for me so once i've shared myself with you i feel like i should be comfortable with you and you should make me feel comfortable do you get what i mean but yeah that's just my take on that guys i just saw the question somewhere I don't know, I can't remember, I was watching something and I thought, that's a good question for real, like when is the right time to get comfortable with someone that you're talking to, a boyfriend, someone you're getting to know, whatever the case may be, an entanglement, whatever the case may be, but I just feel like for me, 
I'd, I'd get comfortable once I've had sex with you because it's like you've already seen me like that's my biggest issue to me my biggest deal my biggest insecurities my body so it's like once I've shared that with you I feel like I should be comfortable with you because everything else is just like minor things like oh okay oh I fired okay cool oh I need to go use the bathroom okay cool everyone uses the toilet but I feel like once you exchange energies with that person like it's all mad i should be comfortable with you you should allow me to feel comfortable you should do things to make me feel comfortable you get what i mean but yeah um that's the end of this video i really just wanted to talk on that because i've seen the question like i mentioned before and i just really wondered for real like when is the right time and i just thought i'd share my views on that but that's that um if you enjoyed this video please like comment if you wish but most definitely subscribe to my channel if you haven't already please don't let me go on about this like it's free just subscribe like i really want to get to 1k subscribers it's not that hard and i'm not that far away so please guys subscribe share the video if you care and please yeah definitely comment below answering um this question i want to know you lots of thoughts and opinions like when is the right time to get comfortable with somebody that you're seeing so whether a male or female whatever your sexual preferences are i don't care but just comment below when you think the right time is to be to get comfortable with somebody that you're speaking to somebody that you're dating someone that you're in a relationship with like when's the moment you're like okay yeah i can get comfortable with this person now so yeah comment that below and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys <laughs>